Hi, Paul and Clark, your Meta Life here. Today we're looking at Rank Tracker from the SEO Power Suite. I've just installed it on an, another PC um, for obvious reasons, really, it's because it's a live uh, document and it's got all my data in it. But I did want to show you as much as I could, so I've put in some dummy data for really the SEO Power Suite and my own site in it. That seems fair enough. Um, so, what's Rank Tracker for? Well, most of you'll probably be aware of what Rank tracking ranks involves it's the keywords the highly commercial keywords that you would like your website to rank for and for most websites you'd have a number of keywords it could be anything from three or four any to many many dozens or even hundreds of keywords you would like your website to rank for and each of these keywords would potentially be the result of a search somebody does on Google Yahoo Bing or elsewhere your site would come high in those rankings and therefore somebody would click on the link in Google Yahoo or Bing or one of the others and arrive at your site and see your product or offering that that's the re, that that's the purpose behind it now if you're running um, you just your own website you'd want rank tracking just to see how good your own SEO efforts have been whether they're having a positive progress or not and at that level it is possible to just open um, a web browser go to Google or whichever other search engine you'd like and actually type in each phrase and just see where your website is uh, if it's not on page one it can be a bit frustrating as you click through pages or in some it let you set the preferences that allow uh, page one to show 100 results rather than 10 or 7 results or whatever uh, but if you've got dozens of keywords that you're looking to rank for you come across a problem quite quickly and that is at about the 22nd or 23rd search at the moment I'm finding Google decides to stop accepting any more searches initially you will get a capture that will say something like there have been a lot of searches from this machine at the moment just checking you're not a bot please enter the code below and you enter the code below and then it gives you about another 10 and then it stops you altogether uh, and then if you wait about half an hour it sort of opens up again your IP address is freed you can carry on um, now that's fine you may still want to do that if you've only got one website and you've got not many keywords that might be appropriate for you to do that however if you're an agency or if you've if you've got quite a few of your own websites or you've just got one website with hundreds of keywords to monitor that very soon becomes a pain in the backside um, for instance at the moment for myself and my clients I monitor across eight or nine clients some with more than one website plus my own website I monitor something in the region of four and a half thousand keywords <clears throat> and there's absolutely no way whatsoever I can do that without using rank tracking it just isn't possible one client in particular actually it, it, <laughs> um, a very large European company actually is almost 50% of those keywords and it's just not possible to to work in that manner so we don't so this is rank tracker and this is the possible solution so I've put in some dummy data here um, this my website and the other the products within the SEO Power Suite plus SEO Power Suite itself and it's telling me where I am in Google rank one uh, Yahoo 27 Bing 24 it, as you know the site only went live about two weeks ago so this is very much work in progress it gives you a ranking progress graph or you can have a look at the um, visibility data for each, for each keyword you click on each keyword and it'll give you the visibility data uh, if you connect uh, Google Analytics which you can you can connect your Google Analytics account to this it will pick up uh, your traffic levels from here as well and it'll also have a look at your keyword difficulty you can you can set a keyword and go right what is my keyword difficulty for link assistant it will go away and uh, uh, plunk that back and give, give me my keyword difficulty it's just going to 98 percent uh, it will go into details about my ranking, uh, the keywords in the top 10, organic traffic levels, all that kind of good stuff within rank tracking. It will give you a ranking summary. So once again, if you have the enterprise level of rank tracker, uh, you can have as many different uh, projects as you like. You create a new project and have a project for each of your clients and have them all update automatically and then uh, a white label report for each of your clients with prints off very similar to material design I'm not sure it is material design compliant but it's it's very close to material design a beautiful looking report which gives you um, something to give to your client um, you can also carry out your keyword research in here um, you can add keywords it gets keyword suggestions it's perhaps at that level there are a couple of tools that are marginally better with that 
right we'll go back to there now there are a couple of tools that are marginally better at, at doing the um, keyword research but not that many it, it's a very high high quantity to quite a quality tool the main reason that uh, rank tracker works for me is that it allows you to separate your projects so easily um, it allows you to um, group keywords it allows you to uh, update multiple times you can schedule updates you can print beautiful reports you can do your basic keyword research in here you can get everything you need to know whether the progress you're doing on behalf of your clients or yourself is actually working or not now there are many tools that do this sort of thing however um, as part of um, the SEO power suite rank tracker uh, if you think of the SEO power suite if you buy the whole suite you basically get sort of one and a half of the utilities free from link assistant website order to rank tracker and SEO spyglass and for something that I didn't actually use a lot until recently um, I used um, um, I used a couple of other tools which did something did something similar. Um, I'm trying to think what I what I use now. Um, I use one. I use SE Ranking was one that I used, and I used one from a forum, uh, a, a private service that was that I bought on um, Warrior Forum, which worked very very well. Um, but I came across blocks at about 200 keywords. It was sort of $9.99 for up to 200 keywords, which seemed fine. You could scale up to a thousand keywords for $29.99, which is again fine. But when I wanted to go to three, 4,000 keywords, it was suddenly costing me about $100 a month, which seems fine because you're only talking about one or two cents per keyword uh, in, if you're talking in the US, but that's still a hell of a lot more than this costs. Uh, this is one-off fee, you pay for it once, and you know for for a year you can have tens of thousands of keywords there is no limit i haven't found the need to use proxies yet it will schedule and it'll update the keywords nice and slowly um, if you want to leave it running overnight and so it only creates so many requests to these search engines every few minutes it will do that you can go into preferences um, and it allows you to do a search safety settings so it allows you to do all this sort of stuff human emulation so it will take time so you say right I want it to run overnight it's not it isn't something that taxes a PC you can have this running on a, a very low-end laptop with the lid shut as long as you have a power saving settings so it doesn't turn off with the lid shut of course <laughs> but you know that you can have this running to just do a couple of searches a minute or a couple of searches every 10 minutes leave it on overnight and when you come back in the next day it'll have done hundreds and hundreds of searches for you um, and there's no need you can add proxies if you want uh, you can do all that kind of stuff if you want to if you want to do things quickly but for me I just I just put it on a laptop and leave it running and it does does it wonderfully and it's always 100% accurate if you tie it into Google Webmaster Tools it drags all the data it brings it all together it will check your PPC as well if you're doing PPC it will see uh, how much you're paying per click what your competition's doing per click it does competition analysis it does keyword analysis in terms of the strength of keyword and which ones you'd like to go for you can group uh, keywords into different groups so if you've got different products for example you can group them up really it, it's an all-in-one tool and for doing everything if I pick any one individual part of that there are probably one or two keyword tracking tools out there that are slightly better there are probably one or two um, keyword strength tools out there that are slightly better there are probably one or two tools that produce reports that look slightly better but there's no tool that brings all of them together under one roof and does and is very good at all of them I mean it is it is in the top two or three of everything that it does um, but I wouldn't go so far as to say it's number one but it, it, it's right up there as an at everything it does so rather than having to mix and match three or four different tools uh, and maybe spend thirty dollars here and forty dollars there and nineteen dollars ninety nine there per month you just buy this as a one-off and it, it does the lob does the does the lot I mean in three months it's paid for itself and at the end of a year you've saved hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of dollars by having this so it's the ideal tool if you either have one website with many many keywords to to uh, keep track of hundreds or you have clients you want to prepare a lot really beautiful reports and each client's got their own unique set of keywords you need to keep them all separate linked to websites linked to different websites linked to different Google webmaster tools accounts and all that it does it all under the bonnet extremely good tool and part of the SEO uh, power suite um, so poor own Clark um, yourmetalife.com hope you enjoyed the video uh, signing off